Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. This is your boy Sneaker Life for the one time. And I mean, this is kind of like a highly requested video. Like people have been asking over and over, Mike, what is good with GOAT? Now, personally, I haven't purchased from the GOAT app in probably about since like 2017. So it's been quite a while. And I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I was sponsored at the time of those videos. This time around, not sponsored at all, period. We know the top dogs in the game are obviously the GOAT app, Stadium Goods and StockX. They are running things in the secondary market. So I wanted to just kind of go over every single one of these companies and just kind of break down my own personal experience spending my own money because previously things have been sponsored, you know? And what's really interesting is GOAT actually got a $100 million investment from Foot Locker. So, you know, that changes the game a little bit. They partner with Flight Club and they have this new thing called InstaShip, which that's basically what I'm gonna talk about today. I have my package here, so let's just go over this. From previous experience, I have not received any fakes or had any shady business with any of these companies. Uh, this is InstaShip, so I'll show you guys what I have in this package. And that's kind of firsthand my experience, my dollar. Let me just break down how this whole InstaShip thing works. Typically when you buy a shoe from these apps, especially GOAT, the, the seller ends up shipping them to the company, the company verifies that they're legit, and then they finally ship out. This process can take from anywhere from three to 10 business days, honestly, let's, let's be real. I mean, I've heard a lot of people like, yo, I still haven't got my package yet, and it really just depends on the time of the season. So with this InstaShip, they actually already have the sneakers verified. So you can essentially get them next day, but it is gonna cost you an additional X amount, which, you know, some of these shoes can really get up there when you do the InstaShip versus just the regular, oh, get the shoe, verify it. So let's just get into it. I'm pretty sure that I spent around like $320 for these. And this is also an early pair of sneakers, so that's dope too. These bad boys come out on the 25th, so literally two days from now. And I did order them on Friday, so this is mad quick. So if you're like me and you ain't got time to be waiting around, you just hit them with that InstaShip if it's available. And we'll see what is going on with these. Okay, so double boxed. They, uh, you know, make sure to keep the box protected. You know, sometimes the boxes get smashed and I know it's not the company's problem. It's usually like UPS. I don't know if you guys ever seen the video of how the different postal services go ahead and ship your boxes for you. You know, you got UPS, USPS, FedEx. Yeah. So this is actually my seventh sneaker that I've purchased from the Go app. And like I've said, I haven't had any problems so far. Uh, these are the 380 Mist non-reflective, which is kind of weird because, so like previous times they usually have like wrapping around the box and then a little goat sticker. They might've changed that up. Probably it was just a waste of money, but let's see what's good. I actually haven't seen the 380s in hand either. And here they are. Ooh, little fart noise for the one time. Wow. So these are the notorious 380s with the boost on the bottom. I'm gonna do a full review. It'll probably be up today, same day. Um, but yeah, I mean, I hope this kind of answers your question. Sneakers are good to go. So there you guys have it, man. That was my experience, super smooth. Like I said, I ordered these on Friday. They got here on Monday, just a breeze. And this is my seventh purchase. Now, this is what I will say. GOAT definitely has a huge advantage with that $100 million investment. First off, you're working with a huge retailer such as Foot Locker. I don't think Foot Locker would invest in a company that is selling any fake sneakers. You know, I was reading an article on Forbes and Foot Locker said, one of the reasons that they invested in the GOAT app is because they wanted to make the customer experience on the secondary market just smooth and easy. So that's just honestly a huge advantage. And like I said, I recommend them. You're not gonna get scammed. I think you're in good hands. They sell new and used shoes, which you know you can buy some used shoes and get a good deal if that's really what you're into. But always remember, patience saves pockets, guys. These are actually really fire, jeez. So 
moral of the story, Goat app is legit. You're good to go. Let me know down below which site I should review next. And also, what do you guys think about these, man? Does anybody own a pair of 380s? Like, are they pretty solid? I still need to put them on feet and, you know, make my own decision, but I'd love to hear what you guys have to say down below. You guys can give me a follow at Mike the Compass on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, SoundCloud. I'm everywhere. But this is your boy, Sneaker Life. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Run it. Hey, it's Jimmy. Yeah.